Hello guys, welcome back to the channel once again. In this video, I'll be installing .NET Framework on Windows 11. So as you guys know very well that we can turn on this feature directly from the control panel, uh, which includes uh, the option to enable both the 3.0 and 2.0 framework with the 3.5 services. Okay. So now you can see that it is downloading all the required files to install the required framework, but sometimes it ends up with some sort of error code like 0x800736p3. So to deal with this scenario what you guys can do to fix this is to manually install this application framework so you can make it work okay so uh, all the required framework links will be given in the description down below so you can pick one by one uh, whichever you would like to install okay so now for the demonstration i'm picking up dotnet framework uh, as 3.5 so i'm pasting it over the browser so we can have it over the system manually and i can install it manually uh, over uh, this uh, PC. So here we have the download link. I'm going to hit over this or you can just uh, tap over the manual link if the download doesn't start uh, automatically. You can click over this link. Okay. So here we have this uh, file uh, downloading over the uh, download bar progress. You can see all and uh, now uh, we can run it and install it. So I'm going to run it with the administrator privileges to install. And it is just going to ask to uh, go with yes okay now just hit install this feature the feature and it will be installing all the required uh, files to make the 3.5 framework work okay now installation is done right done okay so you can see uh, it includes 3.0 and 2.0 framework so yeah the installation is done and this is how you can make everything work and if you go back now over the control panel and you check the 3.5 services is enabled or not you can say you can see that it is enabled by default because we have just installed it over the system manually so yeah there's nothing to worry about so this is how you can install and make it work thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next video